Good morning. This is a class update for the OLE Ingenuity Computers course that you are taking during the 2020 and 2021 school year. A lot of you are finishing up with the Python moving into Word, and some of you are knee-deep into the Word section of the course. I do want to just give a little heads up on what's coming up next. Excel, which is a spreadsheet system, it's a little different than a database, but for most of what you guys are going to be doing in college and in your workplace, you will be dealing with Excel. So this is one area that will most definitely have an impact on, on you moving forward. A couple of pointers that I did want to mention. One, if at all possible, Excel online is good, but having the actual downloaded Excel program is much better for you to complete the work. And let me just show you a way that you can do that. When you go to office.com and you log in with your account, you will notice on the top right there is an option here that says install office. Here you can install software programs such as Outlook, OneDrive, and Excel, something you're going to be using. As long as you are in this district, you're able to access that uh, those programs. Just use your regular credentials in order to log in. You'll have no problem with it. Best suggestion for you, install that into a computer uh, and try to do your assignments on that. If, if you are having multiple computers, please pick one. Uh, oftentimes, it will shut down on students if you have multiple installations on multiple devices. So uh, please keep that in mind. Uh, also remember that you can install a lot of your uh, apps, uh, such as Excel or Word, uh, on a mobile device like an iPad or an iPhone and log in with your credentials that way. So you don't just have to use the browser. Um, please make sure you're following the directions. A lot of people are emailing me. And it's simple things that were listed in the directions that you are missing. Uh, for example, in Python, if it says to put it into a zip folder and upload it, you really do have to do that. Uh, if you don't, you are going to run into conflicts with uh, being able to upload it or even to email it to me, which some of you have tried to do. Uh, if you have any questions, please let me know. Uh, I'm available from uh, 7.55 until 8.40 most school days. And then I try to get back to you when I get home from uh, teaching my regular day. Uh, so you can expect some emails uh, within 24 hours. Thanks. Have a great week, and we'll see you soon.